Good morning and welcome to Miss Rody. And today I will be showing you how to change your Google Analytics, um, how to switch to the Google Analytics for property. Because as you know, Universal Analytics will no longer process new data and standard properties beginning July 1st, 2023. So I I'm, I've been noticing that I've been getting a lot of like alerts in my email. So I just decided to do this with all of my stores and I'll show you, i walk you through it. So right here, this is one of my stores, the Google Analytics homepage to my store. And what I do to change it is I change them all in every store except for one because I want to leave a store to use as, a, as an example. So I'm going to go down to the store that I want to change the property to. And it's this store. Okay, hold on. It's this store right here. My Weddings by Rody. And when I click on it, it automatically shows it. Like measurement ID right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just copy and paste this and place it into my Zazzle settings. Okay. Okay, I have some things I need to. All right. So I'm going to go to settings. Okay. I don't know why it tells me this sometimes. Okay. You want to go to advanced settings. All the way down to here where you see the Google Analytics tracking ID. And basically, I want to just paste the new code in and click submit. Okay, and it says your savings have been updated. Okay, so it was that easy. And it'll take a while for it to process, like start processing. For one of my stores, it took about 20 minutes. But it um, it's going to take a while and to receive like all the data. It may take a few days. Because I'm trying to receive all the data from one of my other stores and it's taking a while. So it may take a couple of days to maybe even a week, I'm not sure, to just start receiving all of your data. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Have a blessed day.